Welcome. In front of me is a OnePlus Nord 2T and today I'll show you how you can bypass the Google verification on this phone. Now, you can see that the phone I have right here is locked. It tells me to draw the pattern to unlock it. And if I close this, it will tell me to put in my Google account that was previously used then uh, on this device before it was well, reset it. So I will need to verify it in order to be able to finish up the setup. So, assuming we don't know either of those, we will just simply bypass this. And unlike majority of the other phones on on the uh, OnePluses, it's actually quite easy to do so. So let's get started. Number one, you will need to connect to Wi-Fi, which I have already done. So you will be able to see that in a second right here somewhere. There we go. So I am connected. And once you connect to your Wi-Fi, go back to the first page. And in here, you're going to select vision settings. And I then tap uh, select to speak. And I tap on that several times. I did mute it just because it's a little bit annoying to me. So anyway, once you see this page right here, you want to draw a mirrored L like this. There we go. And this will bring up a window allow Android access uh, so to record audio. It does have the first option selected in the green outline. Uh, when vision, uh, when talkback is enabled, uh, we can't really use the device as you would normally do. So now each option that you want to select is, well, you fir first tap on it to select it and then double tap on it to confirm it. So like I just did. From here, you wanna select, I uh, use voice commands to so tap on it once. And before I tap on it again, uh, twice, I'm gonna quickly go over what we will need to say because this will enable uh, basically like a Google voiceover or like commands. So first time around, when you double tap on this, you will hear here a beep. And when you hear that beep, you wanna say open Google Assistant. It will open up Google Assistant and then you will hear another beep from that. And you want to follow up by say, saying open YouTube. So well, right now, basically go through it. Open Google Assistant. Open YouTube. Opening YouTube. Now it looks like when I muted it, uh, I wasn't able to hear the beeps. Uh, the only thing that was signifying that it is listening to me, it was this like super faint uh, green dot in here. So when you see that, maybe you muted it as well. Uh, say it like I did and it should work just well uh, well enough Anyway, once we're in YouTube, we will now turn off talkback So you want to hold the volume up and down both of them at the same time Select turn on double tap and hold the volume up and down once more And now we can use the display normally so from here tap on account icon, navigate to settings, about, Google privacy policy, accept and continue and no thanks. And then right at the top, you want to navigate to hard reset.info slash bypass. Now I'll write it down and if you need a moment to copy it, do pause the video. So now would be the time to pause. From here, scroll down to settings and then scroll all the way down to system settings, again all the way down to backup and reset and then select reset phone, erase all data, erase all data and once again and this will now begin a factory reset of our device. This will take roughly like one to three minutes to finish up and once it has we should be then greeted with Android setup screen once again. Now this time around, the device will be fully unlocked, so you will be able to go through the setup however you want. Once this is finished for me, I'm just gonna go through a quick one, skipping virtually everything that I can, just to show you that the device is now unlocked.
Okay, so now that it's finished, like I said, I'm just gonna go through a really quick setup. And there we go. So as you can see, this is how you can bypass the Google verification on this phone. And if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.